Hey, this is Dana. I am here to show you how to print your FBA labels for uh, Amazon on a Dymo printer from Scan and Label in Seller Central. Uh, I know a lot of people have some trouble with this, so I put together a quick video. You don't have to take a lot of time with this, just go through it real fast. Uh, basically, you want to go into your shipping queue or the shipping inventory area, manage FBA shipments, and then that'll bring you to this screen, and then you got scan and label up here. Now what happens is, is you put in a number uh, for a SKU or scan it, and then your item will come up here and you want to print a label or multiple labels depending on which. Um, first thing you want to make sure is on your printer settings that these are within the right range. Uh, for two and a quarter by one and a quarter labels, that I use, these work perfect for me. So you may have to tweak with this a little bit, but uh, once you get it, it's good to go. So you save that, and then we just want to go ahead and print a label. So we print the label, and it'll bring up your printer dialog here. And right now I'm not on the right printer. Um, this is how it print on a regular printer. I have it as save PD, uh, PDF, but if you're printing on a just a regular printer, it would look similar to this. So we want to get to the right printer, and I have a Dymo 400 that I use for my eBay label, so that's not going to work. So we want to make sure and get onto the 450, which is what I do my FBA on. And then once you get in here, you'll probably see some messed up stuff like this. Um, it's because it's not formatted correctly, so we just want to go down here to more settings. And we want to make sure we have our right uh, labels. And the two and a quarter by one and a quarters are 30334 right here and you'll see it's getting better um, and then the last thing we want to do is change the margins to none and once you see what's a good label here then you know it's going to print that way so then from there all we got to do is go ahead and print it and once it's printed you just uh, snatch them off your printer and they should look just excellent like this uh, if you're still having trouble then you want to go back into the printer settings and tweak this a little bit. So between the two uh, settings on the print screen and here, you should be able to narrow it down to just a perfect label and you'll be good to go. Hopefully this helps. If it uh, did you some good, give me a like. Thank you very much.